Hi, we're Frank and Angie. We sold everything and moved to Ecuador. <laughs> Today we're running errands in Cuenca. What's it like to run errands in Cuenca? Let's go buy something. Not at the mall. Okay, okay. I don't understand why no camera in the mall. about how to tell what the bus fare should be when you go into the country or small towns or you are no longer in a big city like for example I just want to show you this you see that sign right there that means minimum fare 50 cents now here's what there is to know this bus I took in Santa Isabel to Cuenca and the bus sign says Cuenca on it. So when I'm in Santa Isabel and the sign says Cuenca, that makes it a provincial bus because it's going out of town. And on that bus, the minimum fare is 50 cents. So then when I'm in Santa Isabel and I see a bus and the sign says Santa Isabel, you know, the same as the city you're in. So I'm in Santa Isabel and the bus sign says Santa Isabel. He's not going out of Santa Isabel. The bus fare on that bus is 25 cents and by extension there's more to know about other forms of transportation they are local forms of transportation you do not see any foreigners on them or gringos unless they're paying taxi fares so there is more to know about it and so therefore if you're in any city say you're in i don't know take your pick paute say you're in paute and it says paute well that's a local city bus so it's 25 cents but if you're in Pauta and you're going to Shorter Lake then it's going to be a different fare I recommend you keep your eyes open and watch what the locals are paying when they're handing the money to the bus driver pay attention you see all this stuff this was not here when we first moved here this is more recent the little lady dumbbells these here are kettle bells kettle bells dumbbells and this is a I don't know what they call them but different kind of ball or bell that wasn't there either so they have quite the variety now on exercise stuff This is a brand new store opening. Brand spanking new store opening. It's called uh, Trujillo. Trujillo. We've got an upstairs, downstairs. It's got pretty reasonable prices on a lot of stuff. They have their own thing. If you buy four of the same item, you get a 4% discount. Oh, I see. That's what that means. Four of the same item, 4% discount. Did you have an elevator? There is an elevator. How's the weather in Cuenca, Brandon? Cold at night. Nice during the day, t-shirt weather. You gonna get a white Christmas? No white Christmas? Who knows? Maybe. Oh, they put a new circle right there. Yeah, it's annoying. right here under this new building right here on the third of mile. I don't know if you've ever been in there. Ice cream cake store. I don't know if I right. don't remember if I've been in right that particular here. one. Yeah. Oh it's, it's a new one. Right here. It's an ice cream shop. Very nice. 
Oh yeah. They've got this new park right here. It's all brand new. So it's uh, branching out into suburbia. You can now not have to go to the center just to sit in a nice ice cream shop. Or go shopping. Or, or go shopping, yeah. That's cool. Kind of suburbanizing. <sighs> All right, so we're waiting for the bus back to Yungiya. You gotta wave them down here. Sí. Amigos con derechos 